everyone. Welcome to See to Learn. We know that a mirror forms an image of an object in front of it due to regular reflection of light. Let's place another mirror adjacent to this mirror, touching one of its edges like this. This mirror too forms an image. Thus we get two images, right? Let's bring the two mirrors closer. Oh, we are getting more images. Why is the number of images changing? It's because of multiple reflection of light by the two mirrors. The light reflected by one mirror is incident on the another mirror and is reflected again by the second mirror. Thus, these two primary images act as objects again and form these secondary images. Now do the images increase in number as we go on decreasing the angle between the two mirrors? Yes, they do. It means there must be some relation between the number of images and the angle between the two mirrors, right? The relation is n is equal to 360 upon theta minus 1, where n is the number of images and theta is the angle between the two mirrors. If theta is equal to 120 degrees, then we get two images. For theta 90 degrees, the images are three. If we reduce theta to 60 degrees, how many images will we get? We get five images. See how beautiful pattern I got using two mirrors placed at an angle of 60 degrees. Beads and bangle pieces are used as objects here. A kaleidoscope also forms such patterns. However, a kaleidoscope has three mirrors forming a triangle. A kaleidoscope is used by fabric and carpet designers to get unique patterns every time. Now, if the two mirrors are at an angle of 30 degrees, we get 11 images. Now, can you tell me the number of images formed when the two mirrors are placed parallel facing each other? Let's see. Oh, we get so many images. They are infinite. But why? The image formed by one mirror acts as an object for the another mirror. So, we get infinite images. Multiple reflection is used in periscopes as well. They are used in submarines to see the object on the surface of water. So wasn't it great fun to play with mirrors and for multiple images? For more such fun, stay connected, like, share and subscribe to your favorite channel C2Learn and also click the bell icon. Thanks all.